these people are beyond help. particular brand of crazy. Kanari take my people. My siblings forget their culture, then go to the Kune for purpose. We're losing them twice. So I get some help from your people. We'll take the Kanari Thunder, make some accidents, and make them hate it. But this... This is all wrong. Which of my people put you up to the theft? It can still work. They're hidden in your city. They'll enrage the faithful and make sure the Kunari are blamed. Me, I'm finished. I just need a few more bodies. A few more. Get back! Don't give him an 
I need a stiff one. And a drink. So, I was wrong about our thief. You'll get used to it. They say we were careless with our trap, that this is our fault. But even without the Sarkamek, there would have been death. This elf was determined to lay blame at our feet. But your feet didn't do anything wrong, did they? Selfishness, want, denial. How do you allow this to continue? If you dislike Kirkwall so much, why haven't you left? Since we arrived, I have seen nothing but greed and weakness. Dwarves, humans, elves, just festering. No order, no goal. You are one of the few I have met with any ability. And yet this too was random, a result of selfishness. I cannot fathom how a mire like this can be justified. You say we should leave, but how can you bear to stay in this chaos? My welcome to the city was not so different from yours. And yet you suffer it. It's an opportunity to make a real difference. Karisten are soldiers. The Kune made it so. They can never vary from that assigned path, never be other than they are meant to be. But they are free to choose within that role, to accept and succeed, or deny and die. Glory is clear and defined. Could you, could not this entire city benefit from that certainty? How else will you know when you have made a real difference? He's free to choose to obey. That isn't contradictory to you. He chooses to be, as do we all, long before any of your meaningless freedoms are presented. Your kind may force our role to change, if the Kuhn demands. Why aren't you more concerned about her supporters? Our enemies strike from shadow because they cannot stand before us. This is not a revelation. And it doesn't matter. I am not here to fight. I am here to satisfy a demand you cannot understand. It's taking long enough. It will take as long as needed. No ship is coming. There is no rescue from duty to the Kuhn. I am stuck here. That is not the understanding of city leaders and their supporters. Let them rot. Filth stole from us. Not now, not the Sarkamek. Years ago. A simple act of greed has bound me. We are all denied Parvolin until I alone recover what was lost under my command. That is why this elf and her shadows are unimportant. That is why I do not simply walk from this pustule of a city. Fixing your mess is not the demand of the Kune, and you should all be grateful! Thank you, human, for your service. Leave. He's ill at ease. The Viscount should know. Who are you? I'm here to report Sir Conrad. I know him. Did he do... something? Or something? One moment. Are you well? Oh, it's just the... you know, it's hard to think sometimes. But I will do my duty. 
If you've seen something, um, suspicious, let me know. I saw Sir Conrad stab one of the city guardsmen. He dumped him in the bay. W what Why would he do that? You're calling me a liar. I saw him kill a man in cold blood. Well, this needs to be reported. I can't believe it. It's three bits. I have something for you. Ooh, what's this? Oh. Isn't that just the cutest thing? Baby animals are cute. Ships? Not so much. Thank you, Hawk. This was a thoughtful gesture. Why do you always win at cards? <laughs> because I cheat, kitten. <laughs> this trinket, it's elven, isn't it? From your clan. Don't bet anything you're not prepared to lose. Here, have it back. A jigger of your finest whiskey for my friend over here. The hanged man's finest isn't much, but it'll get you just as drunk as anything you'll find in Hightown. And you'll wake up and find someone stolen your trousers. <laughs> That's when you know it's a party. I thought I'd have to watch myself around you, but as it turns out, you're all right. What do you mean, I'm all right? You don't judge people. You're not afraid to get your hands dirty. You know, little things like that. If I had someone like you on board my ship when the storm hit, maybe we wouldn't have been shipwrecked. Maybe you would have been shipwrecked sooner. I'm a terrible sailor. Are you? I suppose I'll have to keel haul you till you shape up. Hawk, I've got some news. You might not want to be near anything breakable when I tell you, though. Why don't I buy you a pint and we'll talk? You just keep making this harder. Although I won't say no to a pint if you're buying. I've had an ear out for Bartrand. After the deep roads, he ran to Ravane, probably because he knew I couldn't track him. But I hear he might be back in Kirkwall. He called in loans from a few of his contacts in Hightown. How are you holding up, Beric? Me? My no-account backstabbing brother is practically in arm's reach. I couldn't be better. Would Bartrand really risk coming back here? I think we both know by now that Bartrand would risk anything for money. There's a much better market here for that trinket he stole. And all his contacts are in Kirkwall. I've really missed Bartrand. We've got a lot of catching up to do. I agree. Bianca's been missing him something awful. Let's stop by his new house. Welcome him back to the neighborhood and all that. By the Dread Wolf! been neglecting my patients lately. I... Have you noticed how many Tranquil are in the gallows courtyard lately? And don't tell me I'm just sensitive to it. I've been watching, and every day there are new Tranquil, selling their bloody wares. Good mages, too. People I know pass their harrowing. Are you imagining some sinister plot to turn all the mages in Kirkwall Tranquil? I'm not imagining it. The Templars are using the right of tranquility to silence those who speak against them. They're working on a deliberate plan to turn every mage in Kirkwall within the next three years. 
And here I was, worried you were having delusions of persecution again. There are groups in Kirkwall who help those fleeing the Circle. I've talked to people on the inside. The plan is the work of a Templar named Sir Ulrich. I've had a run-in with him myself. He's the one who did the ritual on Karl. Nasty piece of work. Likes to make mages beg. What happened between you and Sir Ulrich? I've been involved with an... underground resistance. Mages living free in Kirkwall who help others escape. I can't tell you any more, for your sake and theirs. You have too much involvement with the Guard and nobility. Suffice it to say, I've been in the gallows. I've seen his work firsthand. Don't Templars have anything better to do than come up with new ways to torment mages? No. My friends in the Mage Underground know a way inside. A secret entrance under the walls of the gallows. Come with me tonight, please. Help me find the evidence of Sir Ulrich's tranquil solution. What do you mean, tranquil solution? That's what he calls it. His idea of a peaceful solution to the mage problem. To sunder the mind of every mage in the free marches. I'm told he's bringing his proposal to Val Royo, To the Divine herself. He would turn every mage in Thedas into a drooling simpleton under his command. I'll be there. Though this Sir Ulrich would be a fool to keep such a plan in writing. Then let us pray he's a fool as well as a bastard. I'm ready to go when you are. Our entrance is concealed not far from here. I bought you something. It's shiny and subversive. I thought you'd like it. You got me a gift? I hardly think I've done anything to deserve that. Is it a... That's a Tervinter Chantry amulet. Do you want me to get executed? It's sacrilege to wear those in any land under the Divine. Here I thought you fight for mages' rights. Whoever's bad side that puts you on. I like it. Maybe not on the outside of my clothes. I'm not that eager to face the hangman's noose. But I appreciate the thought. I've never really thought about what life would be like in the Tevinta Chantry. In the Circle, they make it sound like the Void itself. The Black Divine stalking Fadus, making it unsafe for kittens and virgins. Those kittens and virgins will just have to find a nice strong mage to protect them. <laughs> From what I hear about the Tevintas, that's the last thing they'd want. The virgins, anyway. I've never heard about any horrific kitten rituals. I appreciate the gift. Perhaps one day I can return one as meaningful.